Hi, I'm Andy Howson, five time world champion. I'm just going to run through some uh, faking techniques today. So, we're going to work off the right kick to start with. All I'm trying to do, I'm, bring, I'm drawing the block out of my opponent. So, I'm throwing the right kick, making sure that leg's coming up nice and high. Throwing that kick, I know he's going to block. Next time, I want to sell the kick enough so I'm bringing that leg up nice and high so I can see where his body weight is. From that, this time, as I lift, I'm going to drop my leg in front. So, I'm just coming here. Dropping my leg down in front of my partner's front leg. From here, the most important thing to do before we, we're going to put the knee onto this, we're going to control this front hand, okay? So we draw the block. Next time we drop, I'm controlling this hand first of all. My left hand comes onto my partner's head here. Again, controlling the position. From here now, I can push my left knee in here. Okay, so there, draw the block. Next time we drop, boom, pop the knee back to position. Change side so you can see the knee. So again we draw that block, nice and high with his leg. We fake, drawing hands up, controlling position so he can't land anything. Popping the left knee to the body. Back to position. One more, so kick, boom. fake it, boom, to the knee, back to position. Okay, following on from that, we're gonna just put the second technique in now. So we start in exactly the same, working off that right leg body kick. We're gonna bring that block up nice and high. From there, we're dropping into the knee, remember, we're controlling this hand, grabbing the head, working that knee. From here now, we're in a great position to put the elbow in as well, okay? So from there, draw the kick up, boom, draw that block, we throw again, landing in, here, control, knee, bam, just pop the left elbow up through the middle, okay? Nice and easy. We're already controlling the head, so it's a simple movement of just pushing your hips forward and dropping the elbow through the middle there, smashing straight through. And one more time, to block, Faking in, knee, bang with the elbow, okay? We can add another elbow onto that as well. You can be nasty with it now as well. So from there, we're doing exactly the same thing. We draw the block, we fake in, we land in here, control the head. This time, we knee, we elbow, and from there, we're gonna push the head back. We've got control of this arm. We're moving this arm out of the way. Oh, right elbow, straight across. Straight on the chin. In a fight, you don't stop anyone with cuts up on the head. Right up high here. You want to be aiming eyes, chin to knock them out, okay? So when you lift the head using the palm of the glove to push that head up, so you can really time the elbow well. So draw the block, fake in, land in here. Knee, elbow through the middle, and then we lift that head nice and high. Oh, right elbow across. Okay, and one more time. So we draw the block, faking it in this time, landing control, knee, elbow through the middle, lift that head nice and high. Stepping across the elbow on the chin. Okay, technique number three. Again, we're just following them from that same theme. We're working the right body kick to bring the block up. We're faking into the knee. We're still using the elbow, but we're going to finish it with a little throw now, okay? So we're working there, bring the block again. And again, we fake. We land in, pop the knee, and we're using that left elbow. From here now, my right foot's really important. I don't want to stay here. I'm going to step through a little bit. I'm going to take around Joe's waist. From here, I'm just using a little touch on his knee and turning him over. And again, so we bring the block up, we fake in, landing, controlling. Remember, this is the important part, controlling the hands and the head. We drop the knee in first and we step that elbow up. From here, my foot, I just step outside my partner. My right hand comes around the waist, my left hand can either come around the waist or you can even just use a push. So from here, and we just turn on the knee. From the other side, so you can see the hand position. We draw the block, fake into this position. We knee, pop the elbow. My foot steps in, and from here, arm around the waist, and like I say, with this hand, it's up to you. You can go around the waist, or just a chop from here. There, and just turn, pushing your knee into theirs a little bit. One more time from this side. Blocks, fake, knee, elbow. Okay, so the next technique, again, we're working off that right leg, round our kick to the body, we're drawing that block up nice and high. We've already worked into the knee, we've used the elbow, so we're gonna change it now, because your partner will be expecting that, so we wanna change it and do something different. So from here, we've drawn the block, boom. Next time as we kick, we drop in, grab the kick. We're catching the leg, pushing high on the chest, lifting up on our, our toes, and tipping our partner forward. So we kick, draw that block. Next time we drop, boom, come in here, catching under the leg. Make sure you don't do this and hook underneath. 
because you'll get stuck and tangled up, okay? It's just a slight grab, so you've got a loose position to then push your opponent. Open palm your hand into the chest, and like I said, don't clutch the leg and tight grip. It's just a slight grab and tipping them forwards. One more time, draw the block, fake it, boom, push there. Obviously, you might not throw your partner on the floor. You might not get that reaction. It may just be that you off balance them. Doesn't matter. If I don't throw him down, and he just follow, follow, follow it, use the technique, don't let it go to waste. 